Round two. Will of preservation. Upgrade configured. Look, the roots coiled around the creation furnace. They've withered. Excellent. Nothing can stop you now. Well, we're in trouble now. All the best. Lance ablaze. Flaming lance. Do you know who I am? <laughs> this big diamond! It's all yours! Not a scratch. <laughs> what are you looking at? Just, just a little something. Think nothing of it. Better late than never. Lance ablaze! Lance, power! Time to twirl! <laughs> Welcome, customers. <laughs> Do you know who I am? This big diamond! It's all yours! Time to twirl! Naughty child, nap time. I am kind of hungry. Shave and focus. Uh, uh, I'm just saying, it'll be a shame if they get smashed to pieces. Time to twirl. Lance ablaze. Lance forward. <laughs> to meet me hey a thousand wonders to <laughs> fight as one do you know who i am this big diamond it's all yours time to twirl time for a shot that's better Hello, welcome customers you. Just, just a little something. Think nothing of it. Nice teamwork. Welcome, customers. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Nap time. Lance, forward! 
Nice teamwork. Lance ablaze! Lance forward! Welcome, customers! <laughs> just, just a little something. Think nothing of it. Better late than never. Sure, I mean it. General Jing Yuan said the Ambrosial Arbor was an unfathomable celestial blessing. At first glance, that deer could have been an ordinary life form, but the ability to heal such grave wounds in an instant. I think I finally understand why the Xianzhou decided to follow the hunt in eradicating the abundance. If Immortal creations were left to spread their branches and roots throughout the universe. Entire ecosystems would collapse. No wonder the people of the Xianzhou wander the universe, never settling on a planet. You are a man of vision, Mr. Yang. It's a shame our ancestors, the Elixir Seekers, were unable to see that hidden curse eight thousand years ago. Perhaps some of them did reject the Plague Author's gift. But how could an entire civilization resist the temptation of immortality? <sighs> Ironic, isn't it? The wise are buried while the fools remain immortal. The Sienjo regrets being led astray by the abundance. That's why they have decided to embark on the path of the hunt. Maybe it's not too late for redemption. Thank you for your help. I realize you must continue on to the Alchemy Commission, to the Ambrosial Arbor. After witnessing what happened here, I know there will only be more danger ahead. Go, friends, and stay vigilant. I wish you a safe journey. Why is he calling me now? You're right next to me.
Oh, I say he's calling. But I'm gonna do that next. But first we have a new Adel. Um, this already happened, so now we actually tell him we actually see Blade. Okay, I guess we're gonna do this. So this is the Lafu's Ambrosial Arbor. It's my first time seeing it. Aren't you a Cloud Knight? Cloud Knights don't visit the Ambrosial Arbor without a reason. Plus, I'm new here. The Lafu's Plague Mark is a tree, while the Yao Ching's is a moon. <laughs> I think we got the better one. I heard that the Ambrosial Arbor shriveled and died a long time ago. How could it suddenly spring back to life and start growing again? The influence of the Stellaron... There's no time for explanations. We must return to the Ten Lords Commission. <sighs> I'm wounded. I need your assistance in getting there. Once we get to Starskip Jetty, you can go your separate ways. Well, there's nothing else for it. We're duty-bound to help the Ten Lords Commission. Wait, why am... Why am the Tableazer? You look familiar. Hmm. Maybe. I ran your facial profile against the records in the Shackling prison just now. Indeed. There were no matches to be found. <laughs> I did not expect such a short journey to be filled with so many twists and turns. How does it feel, Master Don Hung, to be a subject of the Ten Lords Commission? A good answer. Short and to the point. It would seem I've been unsuccessful in detangling myself of matters thus far. I suggest we hasten to Starskiff Jetty and send this judge of the Ten Lords Commission on her way. We must continue our own journeys as soon as possible. Ah, uh, sorry. All Cloud Knights answer to the Ten Lords Commission. Uh, duty calls. Apologies for asking you to stick with me a bit longer. I'll treat you guys when I get you back to safety. Okay, then that's gonna hurt. Um... I guess you could slip away and find a safe spot to hide. I'll come back and get you once I've sent her on her way. Not a smart way to operate. The Lafu is more dangerous than ever. I can't let you put yourself in harm's way. Come on, together is better. I don't think this is the way. Okay, my mistake. Hey, wait for us. Are you coming? You're the first Ten Lords Commission judge I've met. What do you guys do exactly? Our work concerns the Mara Struck and the lifespans of long life species. Oh. <laughs> Hopefully, you'll be the last one I meet for a while, then. Indeed. 
Authorized what? personnel only. This chamber. Sacrosanct. It means this. You sure know a lot. You are too calm. <laughs> That's a. Be careful, everyone. There's still a civilian out here. We must save the dead. I fear not death, for the fate of the Artisanship Commission now rests entirely on my shoulders. Don't tell me this happened right before we actually. Or well, this happened after. Nagi. Not a chance. A sigh. Escape while you still can. There's no hope of the Cloud Knights arriving now. As darkness falleth, think not what is just. To this old man entrust your hopes. You must. Don't try to be a hero. A, a sigh. S since when were you able to speak? Hey, do I sound like a dog to you? No. <laughs> My apologies, miss. No wonder I was confused. I never installed a human speech module in the little guy. <laughs> no. Uh, but what is the meaning of this? I'm the only one left here. The apprentices all fled. You should probably do the same. You just said there's no hope of the Cloud Knights arriving. I happen to be a Cloud Knight. Wouldn't you call this a timely arrival? Come with us for now. I'll take care of things here later. That won't do. As a senior artisan, I can't just abandon my post. <sighs> Looks like we're gonna have to resort to unconventional methods. Are you gonna come with us willingly? Or do I have to ask the guy behind me to carry you in his white death box? I... I... Can you give me a moment to consider those options? Move it! So wait, this happened before we actually meet with this guy. Daddy! Aww. I really wish we could keep this. Miss Cloud Knight, why did the General send you out here all alone? The extent of the disaster means the Cloud Knights are short on manpower. But don't worry, I'll keep you safe. Was that the wind? Uh, this is as... A few more steps and we're at the main gate. Thank you for escorting me. We must go our separate ways. It's just a few steps away. You're not leaving with us? Everyone has their duties and obligations. From the day I joined the Artisanship Commission, I've been taking care of the ins and outs of its operations without a day's rest. And today is no exception. The apprentices fled, as they should have. But I cannot let them see their master flee from peril. This is as far as I go with you. I must see what more I can do for the Artisanship Commission. <sighs> master Gong Shu. No use in trying to talk me out of it, young miss. This old man cherishes his life. He won't do anything rash. On your way now. Everyone has their duties. Let's go. Doesn't look like it wants to let us through. Do you think if 
I yell at it, it could scare it off. <laughs> I doubt that. I think Atsai is the only one here still taking orders from people. Any ideas? Hmm. I've got one. Bring it down. You know, you're getting less silent and more deadly by the minute. Sounds good. Let's get it. We're in trouble now. Yeah! A thousand wonders to raise your fight is one! Do you know who I this big diamond? It's all yours! I'm on guard. <laughs> Lance ablaze! Lance forward! Naughty child. <laughs> Let's be friends. <laughs> yeah! Time to twirl! Lance at the ready. So, are judges all loners? You don't seem to have any backup. Judges of the Ten Lords Commission have always acted independently, each carrying out their duty in solitude. However... However... I have a younger sister. You remind me of her. Wait, isn't she a puppet? How she has a little sister? Okay, how much you're gonna bet that they're gonna have like a scene that they meet, but they're not actually meet, they're just cursing by and then they don't see each other. There's the star skip. The rebirth of the Ambrosial Arbor was bound to bring calamity. The Cloud Knights must be at the Alchemy Commission, next to the Arbor. You should head the same way. Thank you for ensuring my safety on this journey. I will report this good deed to the Ten Lords. And if the opportunity arises, I will return the favor. We're glad we could help. 
She mentioned the Cloud Knights were at the Alchemy Commission. I should find a ship and regroup with my unit. What about you? You want to stay here? No, no. The Artisanship Commission isn't safe enough. How about this? I'll escort you and Mr. Locha a little further. We are most grateful, Miss Sushang. Okay, what are you planning? 